Hello, in this video we are going to have a look at the layer properties. Here in the browser panel I can add a folder as a favorite. Then you can see it under the favorite section. Here I see different raster files in the TIFF format. If I click right on it, I can go to the file properties. That is similar as you would do in the file explorer, and it gives you the file properties as uh, Windows reports that. But you can also choose for layer properties. And this will give us more information about the layer, such as um, the data type, the extent, the minimum, maximum value, uh, the pixel size, and of course the projection. You can also get a preview of the data. That works for any raster or vector layer that you have. Let's try a vector layer. You'll check it for a layer that we used in chapter 2. For vector layers you will also see the attribute fields. You can see the data type of the attributes and you can get a preview. There's also an attribute step that will show you the attribute table. From the browser panel we can easily manage the layers. And we can also show the layer in the file system, in the file explorer. And we can add the layer to the project. This can also be done by simply dragging the layer to the map canvas. With the control button you can select multiple and then drag them to the map canvas. So in this video you've learned how to check the layer properties. For map algebra it's important that your raster layers have the same properties in terms of extent and pixel size and they should have a similar projection. 